The Hill is reporting IRS investigators have uncovered nearly $2 billion in COVID-19 stimulus fraud. Many of the cases involve people making false claims about their business or financial situation in order to obtain money from the government. According to The Hill, Attorney General Merrick Garland set up a task force to go after pandemic-related fraud cases last May. Earlier this month, he named Associate Deputy Attorney General Kevin Chambers as the chief prosecutor for pandemic fraud. We're going to target large-scale criminal organizations who are committing some of the largest and, and far-ranging fraud, um, many of them using identity theft to victimize Americans who so needed this relief. We're also going to prioritize overseas actors who saw our government's relief packages as an opportunity for personal gain. The federal government has committed to paying $4.2 trillion in response to the pandemic. $3.6 trillion of that money has already been paid out.